what's good i'll be back again so today i'm gonna show you how i create this color grading in adobe premiere pro this clip i use sony alpha 7 mark 3 with 18 to 35 millimeter f1.8 so i'm gonna show you how to make this color grading in premiere pro just no lot no preset just premiere pro so now follow the steps and let's see how it is now you see how my clip it is so the things i'm going to do i'm going first first i'm going to create an adjustment layer okay so let me come here for this project okay and then i come here for this new item then you go here for adjustment layer and then you press ok so my video it is in 4k so for this quality 3842 2160 so now you press ok and then this is adjustment layer so now i'm gonna drag this adjustment layer and then i drop it here above this timeline okay yeah something like this now this adjustment layer is where i'm gonna use for creating my color grading okay so now i'm going to find the best clip which has some different let me say like some more colors than others okay maybe i can use this one because it has more colors okay the blue green yellow something black yeah it has more many colors than others okay so make sure right now you click for this adjustment layer and i'm going to jump on on color workspace okay so now you come here for this workspace you see guys i'm in editing workspace so now i'm gonna jump on on color workspace so guys now as you see uh, this is my color grading yeah lumetric color settings which i'm going to use okay now it has six settings all right okay so now i'm gonna start it by here for basic correction okay so and this basic correction is gonna help me just for balancing the white balance and increase some exposure or decrease ex increase or decrease some exposure or something like that okay so let me start it by here this temperature maybe let me just decrease like a few yeah Let me add like minus two okay and let me increase this saturation above 100 yes 20 yeah yes 120 sorry 120 yeah something like this and then here i'm going to increase this contrast uh, this contrast so let me increase this contrast like above 290 yeah this is nice and i have to increase some the small exposure here on this clip okay let me add like 0 0.5 yeah something like this yeah 0 0.5 because you see guys now i got more bright on my on my clip so the things i have to do i'm going to decrease this highlight okay let me decrease it to minus 20 yeah let me add minus 20 here yeah this is nice and then even for this white let me decrease this white a few little bit okay like minus seven all right and then let me increase black here like up to minus 50 yeah this is nice so about this basic correction so this is after and this is oh sorry this is before yeah how my origi uh, original creep it is and this is after guys so now let me close this basic correction so now i'm gonna jump on this creative so let me open up this creative and i have to increase this vibrant so let me increase this vibrant it works like saturation but this vibrant yeah works cool okay that saturation uh, yes i like to use these vibrant okay let me add like 50 right and then for this sharpen when i try to increase this footage like this okay so let me increase this sharpen when i increase this sharpen like yeah 46 yes you see guys when you increase this sharpen you see guys what you get on your clip all right now you you get the sharp 
clip all right okay so let me add like 45 something like this and now let me come back here for fit yeah this is nice okay after making something here in creative now i'm gonna jump on on yes curve i have to close this creative and then open these curves okay so for these curves i have to add in three points okay here on the middle here on the top on other one here on the bottom so they have to increase some um, the small curves yes to add like contrast okay yeah these curves helps yeah like yeah or also it, it works like a contrast okay if you need more contrast yes you can move it down something like this but me i don't need this more contrast yes this is enough for me all right so now let me move down here for this saturation here i have a three settings this hover sat hover who and hover luma this hover sat here uh, yes is gonna help me to increase the saturation of each color which i'm gonna choose it and then this hover sat is gonna help me to change any color for example if i have blue i can change this blue into green into red something like this and then this hover luma is gonna help me to bring my color into yeah deep like thick color yes strong color something like that okay so here first i'm gonna increase you see guys in my clip i have blue so let me select blue with cans yes it's gonna be work together and then i have to increase this blue you see this is the blue yes i increase the saturation of it all right okay and then here i have also green here for these trees and i'm going to select this green so i have to select this green and the small yellow because here on my on my green trees okay there is some yellow color so that reason i have to select like a few and then i move it down something like i move it up yeah something like this yeah move it up yeah in this way so i cannot put it on the center so let me move it up in this yellow side yeah you see guys how the things is looking nice okay now let me move down here for this hoovers who and then also and i'm going to but guys i just want need these trees to become yes the pure green when i try to see for other clips you see guys how this other clip is looking even the grace is yellow but i just want to convert this glass yellow into pure green okay so first let me select my green okay and i have to select this green and i pick some few yellow all right okay and then i have to move it down in this side okay oh sorry here i was in hoover's luma i mean is this hoover's who so i have to select this green and then i pick like few yellow and then i move it down something like this now guys i think you see what the result i get so when i come back here for my clip here this one you see guys now i got the pure green all right yeah pure green like this even for the third clip let me see how it is yeah this is nice and this for the first one guys you have to check for all clip and then you see if this color grading is affecting well for all clips okay so let me back here for my yeah my clip yeah this is nice and then i'm gonna change this this blue too okay so i have to this is the first point where my blue is starting blue with cans yes it's gonna be the same and then i close it here uh, so now i'm gonna move up just a few little bit something like this now you see how my my blue is here yeah this is nice this is cinematic color grading bro okay yeah this is nice and then when i close these curves you see that was before i adding curves okay and then this is after so now let me move down for this hoover's luma about this hoover's luma also i'm gonna use this blue and green okay so I mean, this is hoover's luma and then i have i have already selected this green okay so i have to move it down something like this let me use this clip because it has more green okay let me see how it is so when i try to increase this 
cover so much you see how i get my glass up but i have to move it down in order to get like the pure the good grace okay the good glass all right so and then let me come back here for this blue yeah this is the first point of my blue way is starting and then this is the other one so now i'm gonna use this blue okay so and also i have to move it down so let me come back here is where i have more blue okay so i have to move down this blue like this you see how my blue it is when i try to move it up you see what i get this is not looking good but i have to move it down to move it down like a few little bits okay something like this yeah this is nice okay so about this green guys let me increase some few things okay now you see so i have to yes move it up a few yeah something like this uh, this is nice even here too yeah it's working for this first clip also yes this is looks good all right okay so now after making settings about these curves now i'm gonna close these curves and let me open up these color wheels okay so for this color wheels i'm gonna use this shadow cause i just want this black i just want to add some the pure blue okay so let me for this shadow okay let me add these things in this blue side okay some, something yeah something like this and then okay just i have to add the few blue okay and then i have to move it down you see guys how yeah how it is yeah this is nice so now this is before and this is out and this is after so i add the small one okay and then let me close this color with now i'm gonna open up this hcl secondary okay this hcl secondary is gonna help me to make this skin tone of this yeah of this subject okay so you know guys this skin tone is is red so i have to choose red here and then let me enable this color gray you see now guys now this hcl secondary is already pick this skin tone and even it picks like the other things which are the same color of the skin so and i have to add to increase like a small red in order to pick this skin tone well okay even for other clips you see guys is already picked this skin tone and this one too yeah even these okay so i have to add like a small yeah something like this here too is good and also here too is good okay so and let me add this blurriness here so guys when i try to increase this footage so for example when i add this blurriness it helps, it helps me to bring some yeah to smooth smooth sub yeah something like this okay yeah this is enough smooth okay now let me come back here for this fit so now when i try to add like temperature yeah, some something like this okay and then also here i'm gonna move it up yeah like this one yeah i have to like, i move it up the little bit okay when i close you see how my skin tone it is man this is so nice this is looking good so when i come back here for this clip you see how it is this is before i add skin tone then this is after so even for this one yeah this is before i mean this is after yeah that was before okay here guys you can also if it is not enough for you you can add also yeah like more okay depend what yes why the kind of the footage you have okay and here too i can add more and more yeah something like this but i have to move it up yeah like here yeah here too this is nice this is good also even for this wide this is perfect guys so guys and then i have to close this hcl secondary now when i try to see before and after guys you can't believe this color grading so 
when i try to close this adjustment layer yeah that was before okay and then this is after guys this is how i color grade my clip if you have any question please link it in the comment down below your thumbs up like subscribe yeah edc edc so let's meet in next video peace